Today we're going to make a classic, The Bee's Knees. For this drink, you're going to need a coupe glass, a graduated double jigger, a fine mesh strainer, a citrus juicer, and a cocktail shaker. This drink uses gin, freshly squeezed lemon juice, honey syrup, and optionally, an orange peel for garnish. This is a Prohibition era cocktail, which dates back at least to 1929. It was invented by Frank Mayer, the head bartender at the Ritz Bar in Paris, who also served as a spy for the French Resistance during World War II. But before he got caught up in Casablanca, he created a cocktail for the lost generation that was named after a phrase from the times. For those who don't know, the bee's knees was a fan expression from the jazz age meaning swell, tops, jake, the cat's meow, and other synonyms for excellent. It's obviously a spin on a classic gin sour, and it's reminiscent of a gin fizz, only without the fizz, and honey syrup instead of simple syrup. I like using a richer honey syrup at 3 to 1. It's thin enough to pour and not cling to the sides of your shaker, but still big in flavor. The original recipe had no garnish. The drink is typically served with a lemon twist, but I prefer mine with an orange twist. This variation on the classic comes from the 12-bottle bar by Leslie and David Solonson. It adds a contrast and a new depth to the drink, but if you prefer it with a lemon twist, don't let me stop you. With all of this honey and lemon, you'd think it was tea time. Only make mine with gin and hold the tea. I like using a Navy Strength gin for this one, but a classic London Dry, Old Tom, or even a new wave American journal work just as well. So I'll leave that part up to you. This is a real easy sipper. It's a refreshing and well-balanced drink. Each ingredient shines through, adding layer on layer of flavor, until you have a swinging party dancing to Charleston on your tongue. Before I get started, I like to cut, squeeze, strain, and bottle my lemon juice. That way it's easier to pour when it comes time to measure. Then chill your glass, Fill it with ice and water and set it aside. Next we're going to measure an ounce and a half of gin, add that to the shaker. Measure three quarter ounce of lemon juice, add that to the shaker. Measure three quarter ounce of honey syrup, add that to the shaker. Add ice and give it a good shake to chill it down and give it some dilution. Dump the ice from your coupe glass and double strain the contents of your shaker into your chilled cocktail glass. The fine mesh strainer will catch any chunks of ice that broke apart in the shaker and just give the drink a cleaner appearance. Cut a wide swath of orange peel, being careful not to cut into the white bit. Express the oils of your orange twist over the drink, rub it along the rim of your glass, and drop it in for garnish. And there it is. A drink befitting of its name. The Bee's Knees. Cheers. Click here for more videos. Be sure to subscribe, and check us out on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram.